Investors in Brazil are looking to alternative investments for decent returns, as the government's bond rates have dropped from 14.5% in 2016 to an expected 7% by the end of 2017. One of those alternatives is Empresta Capital, which combines social impact with attractive returns. Joining me is its founder and CEO, Ricardo Jorge Asaf. Introduce us to Empresta Capital. What do you do? Empresta Capital is a financial institution regulated by the central bank that mainly focus on small and micro entrepreneurs all over Brazil. We're almost like a private bank, but upside down, offering highly specialized financial solutions, but to the bottom of the pyramid. Back in 2004, when we started the business, microfinance uh, wasn't explored at all in Brazil, despite the size of the market. So that created an interesting opportunity for the sorts of company such as Impresta Capital. Today, we have a portfolio of roughly 12,000 active customers and more than 70,000 credit operations. And we try to differentiate ourselves with the knowledge that we have in the niches that we operate. What are those niches? Who are the micro entrepreneurs you're working with? Impresta Capital focusing on one niche, which is condominiums, because we noticed there was a lot of small and micro entrepreneurs that were servicing those condominiums. So we decided to finance those kind of projects. Give you an example, we do have companies that install alternative sources of energy in buildings, such as solar uh, energy or even wind energy in certain areas of Brazil. We also do have not only the small companies, but also individuals that are not formalized, but have some sort of entrepreneurship within those condominiums, either on uh, sustainability projects or create a high impact on the community that they work. Now there is a misconception that social investments necessarily have a lower return than more traditional ones. How are you working to dispel this myth? You're absolutely right. When you talk about social impact or sustainability, the first thing that would come to an investor's mind would be an NGO or a or donations. And the other way around is also true. When you talk about high impact investments, concepts such as social impact do not come. We didn't realize, to be honest, that we were uh, doing a lot of social impact investments and also financing a lot of sustainable projects. To answer your question, I think the first thing was actually to realize we were doing uh, that. And the second was how to actually show the investors, measure that. So answer that question for me. How do you show that to investors? How do you measure the social impact you have? We spoke to other microfinance institutions, developed microfinance institutions, and we came across a very interesting uh, project called Social Performance Task Force. It's actually an international organization that sets standards on how to measure and how to show social impact. This is quite recent. We're implementing 2018 in the Impresta Capital, and that goes from the customer level up until the board level and helps you balance the financial return that you have with the social impact you're causing or the sustainability you've been financing. What opportunities exist for Impresta on the horizon? We're looking at two main areas. First one being technology. A lot has been said about fintechs, new technologies, new business models coming along with technology. But we believe the real value won't come from the technology standalone, but by mixing those propositions or this business model into a new customer value proposition. So for instance, we've been investing in a self-service app, but we're linking to a big data analysis solution. So mixing different kinds of business model into one customer value proposition. The second area is services. There's a lot of opportunity for us to cross-sell different kind of services to our customer base, which is needy of financial, specified financial solutions. So for instance, micro insurance assistances, services that are quite cheap with a high perceived value for the customer base that we have. That's what we're looking at now, right now as well. Ricardo, thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Go to empresta.capital.com.br for more on Empresta and sptf.info for the Social Performance Task Force. And please subscribe for the latest international business insights from worldfinance.com.